What's up guys, another tutorial here today. Probably gonna want to put your orientation lock on for this one because uh, it's gonna, I want to put it sideways, but it's uh, it's gonna do its thing, you know, just, no, just put it on. Anyway, Infinity FX is what you're gonna want and fused for this tutorial. Basically, this is like a, kind of like a, kind of like a software type color grading and uh, Basically, you start off with blur. I put it to 22, 22. This is my own personal one, and I know this is very similar to another one that I accidentally revealed. I didn't know it was that uh, that sought after, but um, then basically you go to monochrome, and you tune you tune it down just a little bit so you can get like about halfway, probably like that. That looks about good. And um, then you go down to two color. This is my own personal CC, so it's not stolen or nothing. And uh, you're gonna want to go, go over to any color, and then make it dark, dark color. That's what I did. Then uh, that's good. So you're gonna want to save that. Um, while we're waiting, I want to apologize for any effects that I give away that are like really, really rare. I don't do it on purpose, and uh, it's just it's something that just kind of irritates me is when people get really mad about it. It's like they just kind of. Just push for more new effects and stuff like that, you know. Basically, then go over to Fused. And you're going to want to choose the background to be... Let's see, the background... Oh, yeah, it's an older video. Background is the original video. Foreground is this video. And it looks like this right now. And uh, so basically, you go over to these blend modes. So I think you do have to pay money for these. And the one I used that looked the best was purple ink. And then go into this and just take the volume of one of them down to zero so that you don't get that repeating thing, you know, if you've ever done one of these before. And then just play around with like, the contrast sometimes, and that looks a little bit better. Like right now, I really like this, but I don't know how many other people really like this, but it looks it looks like a software color grade and it's like really really easy to do. You can tune up the exposure and the brightness and everything, play around with that. And um it's this blend mode that looks the best for this exact CC that I made. And uh as far as I know, I'm the only one who's thought of this one. And uh yeah, it's pretty similar to the other one obviously, but it's not the same. So um if you use it, I don't care if you give me credit, just don't say you're the inventor of it. Um, and that's all for this one. I'll see you guys.